Hello and welcome. Today's top tip is about fire drills and whether or not they are completely essential. We've all been involved in a mock fire drill from time to time and I can pretty much guarantee we've all felt like it's a complete waste of time. So we're going to discuss, are they really necessary? What does the law say? Well, the regulatory reform fire safety order of 2005 requires that employees provide clear instructions on what to do in the event of a fire. Scotland and Ireland are fitted with a very similar legislation, but the law rightly includes training and understanding of emergency procedures amongst other things. Despite there being no actual mention of practising a fire drill, government guidance covers the situation cleanly by stating the type of fire safety training should be based on the particular features of the premises and should be tested by fire drills. Obviously, a fire drill will never do anybody any harm and would have to be completely overlooked before being deemed unnecessary. However, if you do wish to remove them from your schedule, the FSO have stated that fire safety arrangements will depend on the size of the work the environment and the activities being held within that environment. However, before you place yourself in the absence of fire drills, it's best to ask yourself one or two questions. Is the evacuation procedure as simple as you think? Are you sure staff will do all that is required? For example, closing all the doors and windows and shutting off fuel supplies before evacuating? Are there any staff members who will need assistance? So, be sure to really think it through before deeming your workspace is fire drill free. You smell burning? You, you smell burning? Burning? <laughs>